Howdy y'all, it's your host Rev. Welcome back to Love It Games. We're playing a little South Park Fractured but whole today. We're gonna go see Manifesto. Please like, comment, subscribe, share the video, and see what we can get into. So we're also looking for any kitties. If you hear a kitty, let me know. Keep out. No, that's not where I'm wanting to go. I like that there's Chinese food. I am craving some Chinese food. How'd you guys all get all over right, here? New kids here? Come on, new kid. Can I help you? Yeah, hi, we signed up for the tour. Ah, uh, yes, the night tour, correct? Uh, yeah, we're a little early. Well, I'm afraid for safety purposes, the tours are only offered from 10 p.m. to midnight. What, just to be extra spooky? It'll be worth the wait, my friends. See you tonight. Shit. Well, now what do we do? We'll just have to wait. We can't afford to let anyone else go in or out of this gate. I agree, we're just gonna have to wait here till nighttime. Okay, how far away is that? Uh, about six hours. All right, just wait six hours and we're good to go. long now still about six hours okay cool this sure is gonna be exciting in six hours mm -hmm. shut up scott did anybody bring any uh snacks or anything yeah we should have bought snacks oh god okay how long now right around six hours still jesus fuck You know, kid, you still have yet to tap the full potential of your time-bending ass. 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 Go to the future? Something that could enhance your ability could possibly make time pass more quickly. 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 You see that AC fan over there? Right there, behind you. Over by the gate. On the left side. Can't miss it. If you fart into that fan, the oscillation of the gas will filter it through the expansion valve, mixing it with the pressurized refrigerant inside the condenser coils. 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 Don't question if that makes any sense, kid. Fart in the fan. Go on. I'll fire it up for you right now. I don't get. Oh, that's up. Holy shit, dude! What the hell just happened? Oh, dude, it smells like rotten meat out here! <laughs> well, it looks like it's night time. Everyone regroup. Hi, we're here for the tour. Ah, yes, come in. No, oh, you know, he's you know, got to fart into the fan. Of a sublime insight recipe. Can we zoom up a little bit? All right. Oh, some young people interested in genetic engineering, huh? Wonderful. Please come in. Oh, hello. Oh, there's more. Hello, sir. My, my, there's a lot of you. Come on! Well. I'm so pleased that you children are interested in genetic engineering. Genetic science began as a simple question. Can a monkey be made to have four asses instead of one? The answer was yes. And now we've been able to give more asses to pigs, horses, everything you can imagine. Yes, little boy. How does that help? Oh, you're one of the cynics, huh? Well, meet me over here for the tour and I'll show you how. Come on, don't be shy. We don't want to miss the four-assed gorilla feeding. 
try not to get your greasy paw prints all over everything. Dude, I will spart on you. Our cages are made from the strongest breakable glass on the market. Don't wander too far now. Some parts of the lab are less safe. Don't touch anything, okay? Not now, kid. I'm working. I gotta be honest. Some of the test subjects freak me out. Whoever is funding all the experiments upstairs sure is motivated. Stop before you break something. Just follow standard insertion procedures and everything will be fine. This lab is unsinkable, like the Titanic. Oh, um, that's how you know something bad's gonna happen. You never say nothing. Well, even the chromosomes have tiny extra asses. Fascinating. Don't wander too far now. Some parts of the lab are less kind of short for our test subject volunteer program. Please have a seat. <laughs> Ever play that video game Half Life? Okay, here we go. Yeah. Here you can see our greenhouse. Genetic engineering is helpful to grow larger tomatoes, onions, cucumbers. Fruits and vegetables with more asses means more nutrition for people all around the planet. What good does that do? Oh, you Bible thumpers are all alike. Don't play God, you'll pay for it. <laughs> Let's continue up to the second level, shall we? Another benefit of genetic science, of course, is combining animals. Like these donkey apes, bunny fish, squirrel donkeys, and more. Once we put more asses on these, we will truly be benefiting science. Will you please explain how that benefits science at all? What's your name, little boy? Super Craig. You see, Super Craig, once we know how to do things to animals, we can hopefully apply them to mankind. You think having more asses is impossible? I tell you it's not. You see, genetic engineering is not just for animals and veggies. We are working towards helping people as well. Here you can see genetic mutations of my dead son. Most people don't remember that I once had a young child named Terrence. Oh yeah, I remember that kid. I was wondering whatever happened to him. Terrence was killed tragically in town when some kids were playing around with a relic belonging to Barbara Streisand. Oh, jeez, I think that was us. So, you're doing this all as a way to bring back your dead son? Bring him back? Well, of course not. I'm trying to give his dead body more asses so he can finally rest in peace. Now let's continue on to the fourth floor. Oh, okay. Fuck. Well, here we are. The top floor of the building and the end of our tour. What are these? These horrible, monstrous mistakes of science. Our new benefactor has asked that we genetically alter some of the local sixth graders and make them stronger and crazier. Okay, okay. Why the fuck would you do that? How do you mean? Why the fuck would you make genetically enhanced sixth graders? Calm down, Super Craig. How do you think we pay for all this? We have financial donors. Our latest benefactor has asked for this army of mutated sixth graders to protect his altered cats. What altered cats? Oh, right over this way. A wealthy benefactor named Mr. Connor has donated money to have stray cats enhanced with more asses. Our company can add asses to things at very competitive rates. The problem is that cats seem to become really aggressive when given more asses. They've proven to be quite deadly. Then why would you bring a bunch of kids up here? Look, there's nothing to worry about. This entire facility has a very complex security grid. Huh, that's never happened before. Oh <laughs> shit, someone shut down the security grid. What do you mean? <laughs> Hello, Freedom Pals. What are you doing, fat ass? So, you figured out my little plan, huh, Freedom Pals? Think you can stop me? Oh, I have someone here who'd like to say hello, new kid. Go up top. Guys? Guys, it's me, the kid. Will you knock it off? Listen to me. Don't make any deals with this piece of garbage. He's an animal. Ah! That's enough out of you, kid. You've been a real pain in my ass, new kid. You should have known not to mess with Mitch Connor. Where the fuck are you? Mr. Connor, if you shut down the security grid, then everyone in this building is going to die. What? Sorry, Doc. Sometimes sacrifices have to be made for the greater good of the city. So long, Freedom Pass. Oh no. So much ass. Many ass cats. Up to 
Alright, so we want to do that. That'll bust the tubs of urine. Yeah. Gotta try to find a way to damage Sam with that hurting nope, nope, us. Glad to be working with you, new kid. This should take out these two cats. Oh well, I really didn't think that was gonna work. Why are you letting out more? Well, we'll look back at this and laugh if we live, which we won't. You ready for a flash mob? Cause I am. That'd be classy. Yeah. Snap. These are cats, not dogs. I definitely should not have hit that button. Those kitties look kind of cute, but they're not. Yeah. Like a bitch that hurts. I feel I should mention that my test subjects have a crazed hunger for human flesh. Might have something to do. You don't look so great. Make way for Mysterion. If I could do that. No mercy. <laughs> Today, you cross paths with the wrong immortal fourth grader. <laughs> Quit trying so hard. All right, these are all lined up. It should kill out three of them. Let's try this. Oh, shoot. Well, we'll look back at this and laugh if we live, which we won't. Prepare to be swarmed. Quit pressing buttons. Yeah. Time to call in Jimbo. It's coming right for us. Get him. Definitely should not have hit that button. Gotta take these guys out. Ew. Oh, that's my friend you're poking. Who am I gonna frag next? Say cheese. 
Well done, but I'm afraid you're still hopelessly outassed. It's time. Oh no. This last multi ass cat gets Amazing. blown up with Kenny's ass. Asses beat their many asses. It just doesn't add up. My poor creatures. We must escape the lab. Maybe. Maybe we can go through some of the larger exhibits. This way, children. That so does not sound safe. Anyway. And a cat food. Vial and mutagen. This one will definitely make the door open. Mutant sixth graders are on the loose. This was definitely not supposed to happen. Ugh, so dumb. Parents are dumb. Yeah, adults are stupid. It's okay. We'll be safe in the tour tram. Oh, the tour tram is offline. Somebody's gonna have to get to the CPU and hit the override switch. Where's the CPU? Down on the third level. Oh, it was silly to put it there, wasn't it? So somebody has to walk down to the third level and flip the switch? One, two, three, not it. Not it. Not, not it. Not it. Not it. <laughs> not it. Sorry, new kid, but it really should be you anyway. Yeah, if you think about it, this is all kind of your fault. Oh, that sucks. Am I the only one who saw this coming? They asked if they could, but didn't ask if they should. Let's get the fuck out of here. Do you think if we called it Coon and Freedom Pals, none of this would be happening? We believe in you. So I guess you're off to fix that tram, huh? Didn't you find a way to get out yet, new kid? Oh, that Miss Connor is some kind of... Sorry, I can't fast pass this out of this one. We're waiting, dude. My dad's gonna be awful sore if I'm stuck... Think of this as your eye of the needle moment. We'll never finish the tour or even live if you don't flip that tram switch. All right. Ah, school is done. Ah, sixth grader. Aslan Davish recipe. I'm trying to see, is there anything? Can't make it across that. I mean, I don't know if that'll work with this. We'll see. <laughs> Some of the things they chose to do, design-wise, is horrible.
We have to use all of our buddies and powers here. Oh, oh. He's in wild. Get down to the third level. Okay, you should be coming to my dead son now. Just keep heading west. Each and six craters. Hey Jasper, get over here, dude. There's a picture of some boobs, man. Boobs? I want to see some boobs. Where? Really is a thing for everyone. Fire. Oh, we need like a big poop. So now we're at eight eleven. Hey. Um, Gazanga magazine, back to our sluts now. Uh, that's not good. Trying not to activate the six graders. Oh, oh. Good luck fixing that train so we can all live. Hey, get 
that single ass Forthy. Get the Forthy. Oh, there's too many. They were gotten. Okay, let's kick some asses. Dude, another puddle, huh? Why not? I'm guessing they're super strong, but not that high in health. God, I hate you fourth these so bad. Mm. Come here, twerp. You like that fourthy? Got a lot more waiting for you in middle school. Yeah. Oh. Pick up next time I call if I were you. I'm really starting to get freaked out by all the actual monsters in here. Yeah. Save a mosquito. Yeah, because we want to do as much damage to them as we can. Still, we can do. There's only four of them. There's five of us. You're in trouble now. Prepare to meet your end. There's like really no good. I'm trying to do as much damage as possible. Here we go. Jim Pokemon. Shit, fuck. Going for blood, guys. Poor Kenny. Sweet. That's it. 
He's cleared the way. The CPU should be right through that door, kid. We'll come down and join you. Plasma has something. There's something over there. <laughs> oh, it doesn't go that way. All right. New kid, thank God. You've got to stop him. He's out of his mind. Cartman, you fucking asshole. What are you doing? Connor brought the American and catch. Sick son of a bitch. Uh, shut up, Coon. Soon this town will be rid of you and all the Coon friends. We're freedom pals, fat ass. We know what you're doing, Eric. Putting cat urine into people's drugs and alcohol to make them crazy? We want to know why. Yeah, why, you sick piece of... Uh, do I really have to spell it out, Coon? This city is sick. We both know it. There's only one time of year when this town is the way it should be. On Christmas. So I joined the Chamber of Commerce and used them to unleash my master plan. Escalate crime in the city, blame crime on mayor, run for mayor, get tons of followers, clone new kid into genetic mutant, win election, make everyday Christmas. What do you think? Pretty sweet plan, right? Dude, quick! Why can't I? It's almost a shame that no one will ever know how perfectly my plan worked. Dude, you've gone too far this time. Nobody's gonna let you be mayor. Oh, no? I've got all the new kids' followers. Every last one of them is now following me. Gee, that was smart. Eric, I know that Christmas every day sounds like fun, but it really wouldn't be. Fuck you, Dr. Timothy. If you guys don't mind, I've got an election to win. Nah, nah, nah. God damn it! Well, there goes the main CPU. Darn it, why did I put that thing on a mobilized trap door? Why wouldn't you? I'm afraid now someone will have to go clear to the ground level and call for the tour tram from there. All right, fine. Hurry up, new kid. We gotta get out of here. Yeah, new kid. Stop wasting time. <laughs> This place has too much chaos. <laughs> I knew I should... It's okay, Mosquito. We're not going to die in here. We will survive. <laughs> I knew I should have installed that app to control the CPU from my phone. What? Boy, that Miss Connor is some kind of dastardly superman. I want to go home. You heard the man. You got to get to that... This would be a pretty cool place for a field trip. I could be sleeping in my bed right now. We got to get the hell out of here. <laughs> Let's get the fuck out of here. We're waiting, dude. So I guess you're off to fix that tram, huh? In a second, I'm looking around. <laughs> yeah, I am going to call it an episode there. So thanks for tuning in. Please like, comment, subscribe, share the video. Tell me what you think in the comment section down below. You guys, accept it.